Okay, here we have our endurance-based session with the football heavily involved again, which is a big emphasis of this week to ensure that we integrate back into the skills program seamlessly and uh, little niggles or, very, or lowering the risk of any um, soft tissue injuries. So really important that you have the football boots, you have a football close by and try and get as many uh, teammates involved in these sessions as you can to really improve the quality of the sessions as well as the intensity. Start with a five minute feel good jog, pick three change of direction drills different to what we did early in the week or what you chose early in the week. So you're getting that variation. Then five 20 meter strides focusing on good techniques. So not high speed here, we just wanna focus on um, how well you're moving with the emphasis being on acceleration and speed technique. Then we've got our threshold. So whenever you see threshold, we wanna think work rate. Heart rates are gonna be high and we're gonna be challenged mentally and physically when we see threshold. So make sure you've got good intent to, to push yourself and challenge yourself on, on these three different blocks. Starting off with two, three minute efforts. So some longer work where we're trying to hold a challenging pace. A is trying to hit above 750 meters, the B is 700s and C is 650 meters. You've got three minutes rest in between, so enough time to be able to allow for two quality efforts there. Get as uh, ideally as close to your first effort as you can on your second effort. Then from there, we've got the football circuit. So if you click the attachment, you get a good visual on what that looks like, where basically we have, we're running around the oval and we're starting with weaving in and out between the goalposts, so getting some change of direction work, um, ideally at a moderate pace. Then from there, spearing up to a sprint pace, then into a stride, which is a solid run, like your threshold pace, into an aerobic jog, and then into a walk recovery, and then repeat that for the second part of the oval. So full oval, 400 or so metres with that one. Um, involve the footballs as well, so try and practice um, a you know, getting some change of direction in there, getting some um, bouncing the ball with both arms, tucking the ball underneath the arm with the sprint, um, so getting the football involved with those ones. Then we've got three kicks to goal where we're focusing on some hard efforts, so kick long down the ground from the goal square and then chase that ball down, regather and kick long again. We're attempting for long goals and then eventually the third kick ideally or the fourth kick is uh, kicking for goal. We've got five up and five down, so you're getting some good um, volume of longer kicks as well as your uh, work rate as well. Then we'll finish with goal kicking, so also getting some longer distance kicks. So make sure that we're practicing those 40 or you're close to maximum distance kicking, as well as some shorter efforts and some longer efforts and practicing this under, under fatigue. Thanks, guys. I hope it's been a really good week. Make sure to reach out if you have any questions or queries. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next one.